All right, guys, let me give you a full walk around on this 1972 Oldsmobile Cutlass. It's a good looking car. Red always pops on these cars. We'll take a full walk around and then we'll uh, get into the details. But this car has a built 455, if I'm not mistaken. It's bored out as a uh, 468. And this was all recently built within the last 1,200 miles. Motor's been broken in. It's got a Holley Sniper. The thing runs absolutely amazing. I will get you some footage of that um, out there on the road. She's got bucket seats. She's got the B&M ratchet shifter, and it does have the tack there. We'll start on the outside before we move anywhere else. The paint on this car presents really, really well. It does have some imperfections though. If you can see there, it's like a little bit of overspray. This area, has been touched up obviously it's very hard to see even with your own eye the camera may pick it up a little better but there's a slight color mismatch there and again you have to catch it in exactly the right light to find that couple of rock chips there back there on the spoiler couple little bubbles there And right there aside from that that's all I saw on this car we'll pop the hood these are pretty cool these are uh, these are not real um, you don't need hood pins to hold that down it opens like a normal cutlass hood but you can see at some point this roof's been sprayed again It doesn't really take away from the car. It is a nice driver. We'll take a look at that motor. We'll pop the hood. Four fifty-five. Got a nice cam in it. See the boxes for the Holly Sniper. There's a lot of wiring here, but that's for somebody else to clean up. I'll grab the keys, we'll crank this one up. Frame and floors on this car are really nice. The dash has a couple of small cracks in it. I This just happened on the way back from the detail shop. Um, so don't mind that windshield, it'll be replaced before this car leaves here. It's got excellent rubber. All right, I'll grab the keys. Just wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. Uh, I'll grab the keys. We'll get this one fired up. and let you get a look at what this is. All right, guys. So here we go. Let's get this one fired up. Turn the key. You'll hear the fuel pump come on. Holly Sniper is powered up. It does have an upgraded Bluetooth radio. Just like that. So it just occurred to me that we did not take a look here. Like I said, the car is really solid. Bottoms of the doors are in excellent shape. Corners are in excellent shape. Interior presents nice. Headliner is, I, I don't want to use the word perfect, but the headliner is very nice. A couple of small things, but the seats are in great shape. passenger side is going to be the exact same thing and then we'll pop the trunk take a look there and 
and let's get this baby on the road. Okay, let me cover this DM ratchet shifter for the guys that aren't familiar with these. Um, there's a ton of you guys that understand how these operate, but um, there's a lot of new guys entering this game every single day. So right here, I cannot just yank this car into reverse, okay? I've got to go up, back. Now the car is in reverse. To go to drive, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm up, back, neutral, drive, right? Pull it down one. Now the car is in drive. We're moving forward, okay? To go back from here, I can do one of two things. I can push this forward to neutral and it'll lock itself out so it won't go to reverse or I pick it all the way up, neutral, all the way, bam. All right guys, I wanted just a little more space to kind of show you what I was talking about. Um, this car has a stiff pedal for just low speed cruising. When you're driving it like this, it moves along just fine. It feels like a Rocket 350 or something like that. You know, good power to move this car. I'm gonna let this car go and then I'll hit the gas. But when you hit it, she responds. Somebody's gonna enjoy this. Okay, so here we are back at the trunk. The trunk lid is actually in really good shape. And so is the actual trunk. The seams, the corners, the quarters, all appear to be untouched and in excellent shape. Let me get you a peek up under the car. My lifts are tied up. So, so much so to uh, I've actually got a tech back there working in the car. Let's see if we can get you a peek. I'll take you around to the driver's side. If I get a clear lift, I'll get it in the air for you guys. But I've already checked this one. Frame is excellent. Frame extensions are excellent. So are the floors. 1972 Oldsmobile Cutlass. Good looking car. Detail pictures will be on the website. Finance and options will be there as well. Check us out at carbarsales.com. Make sure you're following us on Instagram because that's where the action is. These cars go fast. I'm at Car Bar Atlanta. And make sure you're following our other page at Roland Museums.